Welcome to our series about building Go executables. This time, we're talking about code generation. Say you want to build a web server that serves random quotes. And the quotes are kept in a text file. One way is you can embed the text file in the executable and pass it every time. But there is another option. You can do it once and generate from this file a Go file that contains a slice with all the quotes and then walk from there. And if there are errors, they are detected during the build time, which is much better. So how do we do that? I have a utility, which is called GenQuotes. It has a build ignore, meaning it's ignored by the Go build system. But when I run it with Go run, it is going to go over the text file and generate a Go file. To do that, we can use a shell script like .sh or a makefile. But in Go, we have what is known as go generate which is generating code go generate works by adding special comment with go generate i tend to place all of these in the same file called gen.go and you can run it from the ide or you can run it here from the command line and in both ways what is going to happen now is we got the quotes.go file see this is a go file and has a slice of everything so we can work with directly. Note that I added the do not edit in one of the top comments. This is a sign for tools such as uh, static checks and other to ignore this file because this is an automatically generated file. And once we have that, we can run our server and everything works. Note that Go generate is not created automatically. Uh, sorry, not called automatically by the Go build system. You need to manually call it every time quotes.check is changed. Thanks for listening. See you next time.